In Pine City, New York, a heartwarming story has turned into a heartbreaking ordeal. Meet Mark Longo, a devoted pet owner whose beloved squirrel, Peanut, has captured the hearts of hundreds of thousands online. For seven years, Peanut has not just been a pet, he's been a social media star. But after a recent raid by the Department of Environmental Conservation, Peanut's future hangs in the balance. I was treated like a criminal. They came to my home as if I was a drug dealer, searching for something dangerous, when all I wanted was to care for my squirrel. Multiple anonymous complaints led to the raid, which resulted in the seizure of Peanut and another rescued animal, a raccoon named Fred. Peanut has been my little buddy since the day I found him. I rescued him after his mother was hit by a car. He was so tiny and he needed me. Mark nurtured Peanut back to health and when attempts to release him failed, he decided to keep Peanut as an indoor squirrel, eventually sharing their adventures online. With Peanut's growing fame came questions about legality. Mark admits he knew owning a wild animal without a license is against New York law, but he was in the process of getting Peanut certified as an educational animal. If we're not following the rules, guide us in the right direction. I just want to do what's best for Peanut. In just a day, nearly 20,000 people have signed a petition urging the authorities to return Peanut to Mark. Mark and his wife Daniela opened Peanut's Freedom Farm Animal Sanctuary earlier this year, a haven for over 300 animals. They dedicate their lives to rescue and rehabilitation. While the DC maintains it is investigating the situation due to safety concerns, the fate of Peanut remains uncertain.